Hello everyone, Sean here once again. It is March 27th, 2023, and we're back in our daily Wordle. Our bonus puzzle today is the Nerdle. Without further ado, let's get into it. Entry, Wordle Word of the Week, doing really well yesterday. Um, I see a lot of people got twos yesterday, so congratulations to everyone who got those twos. Let's follow up with audio, find out which... Oh. All right. We should be able to get this in the next one for sure. So we have blank... U. Blank, blank, O. Oh, now, where will the A go? If it goes here, I see the word guano. Which is, of course, uh, bat feces. Um, if it doesn't go there, then we have N-A-O. Which looks like it might be a Portuguese word, but I don't think there's any English words left so i'm gonna say it's guano perfect lovely another three which is great because we got a couple of fives recently definitely trying to keep those threes up guano lovely little word um let's move on to wordle bot reframe so we don't forget that and check out 93 skill 73 luck all right finally we're getting some luck coming around uh, average luck on entry, which means that entry will, on average, get us down to 145, as expected. Um, entry's a pretty good guess, but not the top, so you'll get down to that 140 range. Uh, for reference, Aegis is about 115 on average, I believe. Um, I think Slate gets down to just, just about 100, or maybe even just slightly under. Uh, audio. Incredibly lucky here, 95 luck. And one guess left, which was, of course, Guano. Lovely. Wordlebot, same. Uh, locked in the A early. Churn, a very interesting one here. Uh, but also locking that in. I'm sure that was the only, only guess left. All right. Let's check out the Nerdle. Four times three plus zero is twelve. All right, look at this. So we know a ton about this already. So a single digit times, we're going to have to have division or subtraction here. I think it's going to be division. So obviously we can't multiply by a triple digit number and get a single a double digit, so that's not going to work. So we do need something here. Now, this could be low. This could be, say this is... 1 times 4. We can absolutely subtract off. Um, well, this would have to be big enough to get into two digits first. Um, so let's say this is uh, 5 times 4 minus... Ooh, you know what? This is actually really interesting. We're going to be in double digits here, so this could be pretty much anything. It would have to be at least... 40 to be anything there. I wonder if we can figure out exactly what this could be and rule that out first. So, the highest we could get, because this can't be 0, the highest we can get would be 80 if we did 9 times 9 minus 1. This would be 80 here. So we can't do that because we don't have a 4 anywhere. So this can't be that. Otherwise, we could come into... The highest we could do over here would be to somehow end up with a 4 here or here. So where might that 4 go? I think the next highest we might be able to do... Because we have to include these three, basically over here, if we're trying to go for a high one. Would be... 9 times 6 would be 54, minus 4 would be 50. But then we don't include our 1. So 
So 9 times 5 would be 45. Minus 1 would be 44, but it would include a 0. I think that we can actually rule out subtraction here. I think if we do division, this is actually going to work out better. So what if we did 8 times 5 divided by 1 equals 40? That satisfies everything. There we go. All right. Beautiful. Another 2. Let's pull up the stats for that. 2s are not very common here. I actually have more um, Wordle 2s than I do Nerdle 2s. Interesting. I do have more Wordle entries than I do Nerdle entries. That is true. But... Uh, about about the same overall. I've been doing Nerdle for quite a while. And uh, twos, are, twos are fairly rare. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like and subscribe. It really does help me a lot. And share this video with anyone you think would enjoy some daily word puzzles. That's all for now, and we will see you all tomorrow.